In this video, we'll learn how to clean a Mac. The first thing that we want to do is go up to the Apple icon in the upper left hand corner and go down to App Store. So what we'll do first is just check to see if there are any updates. Then if there are, go ahead and update your computer with the software. Now the updates won't always show up so you may want to restart your computer, but you should be doing this anyways about once a month. So you can just select restart, but we're not going to do that right now. So the next thing that we'll do is go into about this Mac just so we can see how much hard drive space is left. So this is going to be a pretty good indicator how full your computer is. Now this one hardly has anything on it because we just use it for browsing. It's an older model and it's kind of slow. But you want to make sure that you have plenty of hard drive space left. And we'll see how to clean up our files and free up space later in the tutorial. But for now, let's go into Finder and I want to show you a tool to clean up the hard drive. So go to Finder and then go over to Applications. And once you're in Applications, go down to Utilities, which should be at the very bottom. Then inside of Utilities, you want to just select Disk Utility. Inside of Disk Utility, go up to Macintosh HD for hard drive on the left. And now we're just going to do a little bit of hard drive cleanup and maintenance. So make sure you're in First Aid and then go down to Verify Disk, Repair Disk, Verify Disk Permissions, and then Repair Disk Permissions. And this should clean up and preserve the well-being of your hard drive. So once you've done that, you can exit out of Disk Utility. And then I just want to show you where some files are that you can clean up. So you'll want to go into All My Files as well as iCloud and just sort through any files that you have that you want to get rid of so you can free up hard drive space. Now if you're having trouble finding files, you might just want to put a period in the search bar and then all types of files will show up because every file has a period in the extension. So two other quick tips that I'm going to give you are to keep your desktop nice and clean. Just try to organize as many files as you can into a single file and you also don't want to have too many programs running in dashboard. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.